Ladies and gentlemen, I think you've all heard about the man who actually paid a million dollars for a movie story. His name, of course, Samuel Goldwyn. And the story he bought was Guys and Dolls. Now, because I felt that this was the greatest musical I'd ever seen, I actually made four flying trips to the Pacific Coast to film excerpts of the show for my Sunday night tv -er over the CBS network. And it is my idea of a wonderful picture. Now, incidentally, that million dollar check that Sam wrote was only a starter. Before he was through, Guys and Dolls had cost him five and a half million dollars. And in Runyon's language, that is a lot of lettuce. Now, what does Sam Goldwyn get for it? Well, among other things, he got Damon Runyon's world of fabulous characters. The jails must be empty tonight. Can anybody be missing but Terry the horse, Liver Lips Louie, Angie the Ox, Society Max, and here is a face for which I cannot supply a name. May I ask where you come from? East Cicero, Illinois. And what is your occupation there? I'm a scout master. Marlon Brando never danced or sang a note in his life until he met Golden. But he sings and he dances in Guys and Dolls and he'll fracture you. Gene Simmons, too, is a dramatic star, not a singer. But as Sister Sarah of the Mission Doll, she's adorable and her singing voice is terrific. Together, these two generate excitement that's electric. Let me show you what I mean. Would you be open to a proposition? I've had those, no. Don't flatter yourself. I'm talking business. I am in a position to supply you with the raw material you need for your work, namely sinners. How? Frank Sinatra has amazed the entertainment world with his dramatic prowess. Now to prove he's still the top song interpreter, here he is as Nathan Detroit. Oh, Adelaide, Adelaide, ever-loving Adelaide is taking a chance on me. You're at it again, you're running the game. I'm not gonna play second fiddle to that. I'm sick and I'm tired of stalling around. I'm telling you now that we're through when I think of the time gone by. Adelaide, Adelaide. The way I try. Adelaide. I could honestly. <laughs> Vivian Blaine was a comedy sensation in the original cast. She's even funnier in the picture. With four great stars like these, Goldwyn needed a writer and a director just as big. He found both these talents in four-time Academy Award winner Joseph L. Mankiewicz. The result is sheer greatness. One short scene will show you what Joe Mankiewicz can do with a few simple words. Whatever you do, wherever you go. Why, Sister Sarah, why? I want to be with you. The world's full of souls closer to salvation than mine. Anytime, anywhere. Easier to save and much more worth saving. You, you. The music of Frank Lesser is always a part of the story. Michael Kidd's imaginative dance direction even tops the exciting job he did in Seven Brides for Seven Brothers. Now he has the Goldwyn girls to work with. Of all the grand entertainment ever produced by Samuel Goldwyn, an Academy Award winner himself, this is his best. With its humor and drama, its songs, its beauty, no musical ever made can compare to Guys and Dolls. And with stars like Marlon Brando, Gene Simmons, Frank Sinatra, Vivian Blaine, and a cast of hundreds in Cinemascope and Color, the toast of the town predicts that Guys and Dolls will be the toast of the world.